Yeah, the only difference between Lego and Dagger may be that you, you don't step on them and you're like, ah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. <laughs> when you have kids at home. Uh, at that, at one point, Docker, with this technology company, it was the most dominating technology at that time, you know, mm. almost as the Linux kernel is and was. Right. What is your vision for Dagger? Uh, well. You have very big shoes of your own uh, shoes that you're doing. Yeah, well. I like to solve problems I'm excited about, you know, and, and I like once I'm building a solution, I, I want a lot of people to use it. Um, a lot of people have a pipeline problem. You know, it's just a universal problem across any software team. Uh, we have a, an online community that's very active, very passionate. We have a Discord server where everyone comes and talks and helps each other out. And we have people from everything from students, hobbyists, researchers, banks, government agencies, startups, you know, video games. Everyone has a CI pipeline and everyone hates it <laughs> or wants to make it more efficient. So that's, I, I love that aspect of building a community. And of course, I want that community to grow and to be very large. Ubiquity would be great. The one thing Dagger has that I really wanted Docker to have, but we never got there, is um, an actual software ecosystem. You know, you, everybody uses Docker, or you know, it's very easy to use Docker, but you don't write code for Docker. It's not a platform. It's not an OS. It's a tool. Uh, Dagger aspires to be an OS, something you program that you write code for. Um, but it's a very specialized one. It's an OS for pipelines.